What is happening, my people? Perfecta Chaos here, and we are back on Generation Zero. And this mission is called Arms Race. Now, if you don't have this mission in your mission log, this mission picks up directly after the mission, making some noise. So I will stick a link up on the screen and on in the description. Uh, so if you haven't seen that or done that or completed, go check that out now. Um, but if you have, uh, you will know that we are here. Uh, we were last um, setting off an air raid a siren in the um, lighthouse. And so now our next port of call is to speak to Anita and Benny about the police station. And they can be found here at the hotel. It's uh, We're on the island. Um, we've been here before, so just show you on the map quickly. This is the location here. Uh, so we'll spawn in here and see what they have to say. Look, we know there are weapons and ammo locked away in the police station in Himarvet. If you manage to get them for us, you'll get a few as well. Okay, so checking the map, uh, we're told to head to the station to check it out. Now, um, from our current location here at the hotel, it's actually northwest in this large, large body of buildings here. I'll just zoom in just to show you on the map here. So I'm going to probably walk up from the south here um, and then uh, pick up when I'm close. With Roland, Nisse and the others dead, we don't even have anyone left skilled enough to get there and come back alive, let alone able to hold a weapon, except for you. Let's just focus on what we can do. Also, do you know where the keys are? Also, she was, uh, no, she is a police officer in Himarvet. Okay, she said they should be in her partner's car. Okay, so upon entering the area, we're given that audio cue. And we're told to look for the car. There should be some documents in it. We're just going to head left of this tank here, through this fence. And outside these yellow blocks, we will find the car parked here. I'll show you where it is on the map. So we're currently facing south, looking at the back of the car. So checking the map, I've come into town. We got the audio queue here at this T-junction. I've headed up the main road. We've come between the tank and a fence, and we're now outside this building here. With this just this group of buildings here, we're just here. No keys in the car. Shit. All right, if you found his address, try his apartment. Okay, so now we've got the paperwork. We're told to check Winlon's building because there should be some keys in there. Just left of that, we're going to head down in between these yellow blocks here. Look out for this blue, uh, this blue unit here. We're going to go left. We're going to go left at that blue unit, and the door is just here. So we've come, we've come down the road and through this door. When we come through this door, we're going to head down the stairs. And what we're looking for is the first room on the right. There should be a set of keys next to a body. Okay, now that we have the keys, we're told to head to the police station. The police station can be found just down the road here. So coming out the building, heading back to the blue unit, we're going to find the main road here. We're going to follow the main road to the left, heading towards the there's a fuel station up here, it's quite recognisable. When we get to the end of this road here, we're going to turn right, follow this path, and we will find that the police station is just on our left. Okay, entering the police station, there's three, um, there's three cabinets we need to mark. Heading through this door here, there are quite a few apocalypse ticks about, so deal with them. Just to this first room on our right here, there's a cabinet here, so we'll mark this one. Rock on. We'll get a group to get them, alright? Me, Osa, and maybe Baru? If we all make it back, that will be the true miracle. Okay, so we'll head to the second one. Coming out of that door, we're just going to double round on ourselves. And in through this door, just on the left behind the door, is the second cabinet. 
from the second cabinet, turning around in through this door, we'll find the third and final cabinet. Okay, so that completes the mission arms race. Check in the mission log, you'll see there were several mission items to collect. We got all of them. Uh, the letter that we found in the back of the car, the key that we found next to the dead body, and the three weapon storage cabinets that were in the police station. So that's all mission items and all objectives completed. If this has helped you in any way, please give it a thumbs up. To see more from me, hit that subscribe button. My name is Perfected Chaos, and I shall catch you guys on the next one. Peace.